Welcome back to the Daily Venture as I talk about Black Panther, Trevor Noah hints. He may make a return to Wakanda forever. As Noah recently reminded audiences, talk show host and comedian Trevor Noah have technically been included in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. He also replied to inquiries about whether or not he will come back to the Marvel Studios' forthcoming Black Panther, Wakanda Forever. Talking to Jimmy Fallon, Noah conferred his vocalized version as Griot, the AI designed by Shuri who helped Agent Everett Ross during the movie's last pivotal match against the first Black Panther movie, Killmonger. When questioned if he would come back as what he characterized as, African Siri, Noah said, I'm just saying you should watch it. The performer was originally uncredited when Black Panther came to theaters in 2018. His moniker was subsequently counted when the movie came to home media. Therefore, Griot only appeared in the forthcoming film and seemed to be the primary AI, helping Shuri, and her tasks as Jarvis earlier did for Tony Stark. Although Noah's involvement is debatable, Griot's creator, Shuri, is positioned to recreate a more significant role in Wakanda forever, with marketing and information laboriously indicating she will inherit the legacy of Black Panther. Nevertheless, this has not been officially established by Marvel Studios, and trailers and clips have not presently connected Shuri to the Black Panther suit. On top of presenting a new beginning behind the disguise, Black Panther, Wakanda Forever will even give an altogether new culture to the MCU in the state of the underwater dwelling individuals of Talokan, a reimagining of Atlantis sketching from Mesoamerican civilizations and narrative for motivation. Actor Tenoch Huerta, who portrays Namor in the forthcoming movie, once described, you can take Atlantis from Greek myth, or you can adapt from a real culture. He also clarified how the first Black Panther movie's circumstances will guide the sequel's affairs. Facts are short, but Werda told Teachal Law's conclusion to show the verity of Wakanda to the globe at the ending of Black Panther has set Talokan in trouble. It's unsure how just this happened. The trailers offered a peek at the war between the powers of Talokan and Wakanda, with the sunken society apparently capable of holding its own against Wakanda's state-of-the-art technology. So that was the news about the upcoming Black Panther sequel. Are you a fan of the movie? Do you think Trevor Noah will portray Griot in the forthcoming film? Who would you like to see pop up in the sequel? Either way, thank you for watching, and please leave a like and comment below, as I would greatly appreciate it. Until then, venture onward. Black Panther, Wakanda Forever comes to theaters on November 11th.